Thank you for joining us on this historic day. I, Joseph Robinette Biden Jr. I, Kamala Davy Harris. Do solemnly swear. We're going to be signing a number of executive orders over the next several days. No time to waste. Get to work immediately. Over a year ago, no one could have imagined what we were about to go through. But now, we're coming through it. President Biden announced that the nation has administered 50 million doses of coronavirus vaccines. We reached our 100 million shots goal in just 58 days. We've reached 150 million shots in arms since entering government. The U.S. is about to deliver the 200th million COVID shots since President Biden took office. Today, we did it. We still have a long way to go, but that's an important marker of progress. I'm so excited to finally be getting the vaccine. Everybody is eligible as of today. Right now, we are reopening schools safely so that kids can get back to their classrooms and learning with their teachers and their friends. The bill as amended is passed. The $1.9 trillion COVID relief bill to get stimulus aid directly to struggling Americans. Help is here and we will not stop working for you. With this upcoming stimulus check, I would like to pay some bills. Buy food for my girls. Finally repairing the flat tire in my car that I haven't driven for months. I'm proposing a plan for the nation that rewards work, not just rewards wealth. As caregivers, we tend to neglect ourselves because we're caring for others. We would love to have more product, more manufacturing here in the United States. Two women to be appointed to positions of four-star combatant commanders. The Biden-Harris cabinet, it will be historic. The first black U.S. Secretary of Defense, first ever openly gay person. The first Latino. First openly transgender official. First Native American to be confirmed. This is the first in American history that looks like America. One, two, and three. We will repair our alliances and engage with the world once again. Thank you in advance for all the great work we're going to be doing together. I intend to uh, rebuild and reestablish our alliance uh, starting with NATO. Prime Minister Suga and I affirmed our ironclad support for U.S.-Japanese alliance and for our shared security. I'm now the fourth United States president to preside over American troop presence in Afghanistan. I will not pass this responsibility on to a fifth. After 100 days of rescue and renewal, we're working again, dreaming again, discovering again, and leading the world again. We have shown each other and the world that there's no quit in America.